good morning students welcome back to your online class today i'm going to discuss the remaining question answer of a snake charm story okay from your workbook so we have discussed up to question number 3 okay then comes to page number 6 and we will start from question number 4 okay why are snakes called farmer friends why are snakes called farmer friends everyone should follow me i will write those answer in board so you can copy it in your full copy okay full evs copy so i am writing answer to this question why are snakes called farmer strain okay note down all of you snakes kill snakes kill animals like animals like rats that damage that damage food crop food crop as they prevent as they prevent destruction as they prevent destruction of food crops that farmers grow that farmers grow for his livelihood for their livelihood again who has turned on srijita mondal please mute your microphone and Hence, <laughs> hence, they are called farmers' friends. They are called farmers' friends. can you see the answer properly there i have written there i have written snakes kill animals like rats that damage food crops as they prevent destruction of food crops that farmers grow for their livelihood and hence they are called farmers friends is it clear to you everyone is it clear What is happening? Ma'am, your video is changed. Ma'am, now it is CBS class. Yes, CBS class. Deepa, ma'am, you should go to your your class. This is five fine. Yeah, I am here. I think I am here. Deepa, ma'am, I am Mohita Ghosh, ma'am. This is CBS yeah, class, I'm five fine. Okay, you must join your class. Can you hear me, Deepa, ma'am? Students, now can you see the board? Now can you see? Ma'am, please come. Where is it, ma'am?
Hello, student. Shuvilaja, are you there? You are audible, but not visible. Yes, I can see off. you. Yes. Yes. Your video is off. But my video is on already, student. Now? No, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Now, can you see the board? Now I can see the board. Okay, okay. You can note down the answer, okay? Snakes kill animals like rats that damage crops as they do. Uh -huh. That farmers grow for their livelihood and hence they are called okay. farmer string. Okay? Note down all of you this answer. I can see you. Okay. Ma'am, please repeat the answer. Yes. Again, I am telling. Snake kill. Sorry, snakes kill animals like rats that damage food crops. As they prevent destruction of food crops that farmers grow for their livelihood. And hence, they are called farmer's strain. Now, is it clear? Okay, you have completed very good. Who is there? Let me see. Devoshmi? Yes, just, uh, just tap over the speaker. Okay. Yes. Now you have done. Okay. Ma'am, the board is hazy. Maybe you need a problem, but board is clear. Ma'am, it is reflecting. It is reflecting. Yes, ma'am. Everyone, is it clear or reflecting? Can you say? Ma'am, it is clear. It is clear. It is clear. I, I, yes, yes. I think your network problem, Devushmi. It is clear totally. Um, uh, I have adjusted. Network problem. Others network problem has happened. Yes. It is clear, ma'am. Yes, it is clear. Next question I will discuss. Next question, who is known as Sapera? You know this answer. Sapera is the name given to the snake charmers of India, which are actually nomads that travel to the third desert and set up two camps. So you must write down this answer. Who is known as Sapera? Note down. Sapera is a name given to the given to the snake charmers. Snake charmers of India. Got it? Now, which sorry, there you must type. They are sorry, they travel, they travel through. The third desert, the third desert, or set up through camps. Now, 
Note down this answer. Sapira is a name given to snake charmers of India. They travel to the third desert and set up to camp. Okay. Note down all this. Okay, very good. Ma'am, side, please. Yes, I'm giving side. Ma'am, please repeat this question. Yes, Sapira is the name given to the snake charmers of India. They travel through the third desert or set up through camps. Now, is it clear? Yes, ma'am, now it is clear. Okay. Now, the next question in your book, that is question number six. Why has the government made laws that no one can catch wild animals? Okay. So note down this answer. All of you. Six number. The government has made the government has made laws that no one can catch wild animals catch wild animals because The number of wild animals are reducing or decreasing, are reducing, and they are getting endangered, and they are getting endangered again who has turned off their microphone endangered so they must be protected and reserved and reserved for future generation along with this answer you can write already few species are Few species are already being extinct. Uh, please, uh, spelling of the species. I cannot see the word. S P E S P E C I E S. Okay. S P E C I E S. Okay. Now again, I'm repeating the answer. The government has made laws that no one can catch wild animals because the number of wild animals are reducing or you can say de decreasing and they are getting endangered. So they must be protected and reserved for future generation and few species are already been extinct. Okay. Note down this answer. All of you.
Ma'am. Yes, sir. Ma'am, what you have written on the fourth answer, last line? Last line. Okay. Yes. Last line. I have written. Few species are already being extinct. Okay. No, ma'am. Already... Number four. Number four. Okay, okay, okay. Last. Line and hence they are called former strains. Now is it clear? Yes, ma'am. Okay.